but okay, I'm going to try again. It's been three months today since I did my last video, which I don't have any excuse for. I just uh, haven't been able to get it started. A lot has changed for me in the time I've been making videos. A lot has changed about me, but um, <laughs> one thing that doesn't seem to change is being able to get a video started. That always is the tough part for me. But when I first got started making them, I had a lot of anxiety during making the video. And uh, after I posted it, I had a lot of anxiety. I was pacing the floors and couldn't sleep you know, for like into the next day. And now when I post them, I don't even really think all that much about it. I'll go and check and see if anybody wrote anything in, made any comments. That's about it. It, it just it doesn't really bother me anymore. It doesn't, <clears throat> it doesn't bother me to, to make them anymore. It's just that getting started and getting it going. But I guess I'm kind of like that on a lot of things. But like I was saying, I, I have changed an awful lot. This this uh, this deal with making videos on YouTube has done me nothing but good. And I can see the difference, you know, when I watch my early videos. I just, I don't even feel like the same person anymore. I've just changed so much. <clears throat> I think a good a good illustration of that is this last Thanksgiving. I it was the first time that I've been to a holiday dinner like that with other people in at least fifteen years. And last year I was intending to do the same thing and, and go for my first time. And I was real nervous, of course, for days before, and especially the night before. That morning, I was you know, sitting there trying to uh, you know, think positive thoughts and, and try and convince myself I wasn't going to have a panic attack there. My stomach was all upset, and I was figuring I probably wasn't going to eat all that much anyway when I got there. But then uh, we got snowed in, and so we couldn't go anyway. I ended up staying at home. But this year, we didn't get snowed. We didn't get snowed in, and I did get to go. And the night before, I wasn't nervous at all. I was just looking forward to it. That morning, I felt just fine. I went and ate a big breakfast before I went. I had a great time there, enjoyed myself. Uh, of course, didn't have any panic attacks, and had a good time. I mean, it was it was night and day compared to what I was like a year ago. I don't have any problems uh, going to the store or anything like that anymore. Um, I still can't drive. I'm still a bit nervous about cars for some reason, but one thing at a time. <clears throat> I've, I've just made such strides in other areas that I'm not really going to bother with you know, worrying about that too much figure that out later. But things definitely have changed a lot for me. Being able to just go to the store when I feel like it and 
not have to plan for it and anticipate it and you know, be nervous the whole time and, and be uh, you know trying not to pass out and get you know, and freak out the whole time I'm inside the store. I don't have that problem anymore. I just you know, it's time to go to the store. I can get up, I go to the store. I'm fine when I'm down there. I've, I've not really had to even really focus on not panicking. I just focus on getting my shopping done. And I forget a lot less stuff <laughs> when I go. So that's that's been a huge improvement. Um, when I first started making these videos, I had a terrible time with being seen, being photographed. And I've not only been making YouTube videos, but I started a Facebook page and started posting pictures of myself and my dog and me and everything. And, and just, you know, it doesn't even bother me anymore. You know, that, that has been a, a form of therapy for me too. Uh, when I started all this, just commenting on somebody else's video or you know, going to write on a forum or anything like that online would make me sweat and make my heart race and make me nervous and now I go on Skype on cam with people and I'm just fine with it. Uh, you know, I, I chat online with people all the time and it doesn't bother me at all. I have a good time with it and enjoy it. So that's, that's been another really big change. You know, like I've said before, I don't really feel that I'm, that I can call myself agoraphobic anymore. I mean, you know, the, uh, the fear of panic attacks doesn't keep me from going anywhere anymore. I just go, if I'm going to have a panic attack, fine. I'll have a panic attack. I don't, you know, I don't worry about that and think, you know, I, I'm, I don't sit there and, and uh, not go somewhere because I'm afraid of that. And I think that's, that's what, you know, how I would define being agoraphobic is when it keeps you from doing things, it keeps you from going anywhere because of that fear. I still have uh, some anxiety with people. I'm still not all that comfortable in social situations, but I've got a lot better. I'm making a lot of improvements in that department. Um, I don't have that much problem talking on the phone. It's kind of like with making the videos, it's a little hard to get started. It's a little hard to dial the number and make the call, but once I'm talking, I'm just fine. And I don't get off the phone and then wonder about what I said and if I said anything wrong or anything like that. You know, I don't sit there and, and have a lot of anxiety about that kind of stuff. Um, I'm still not real talkative with people in public, but I am able to like uh, go and ask someone in the store for help or something like that, whereas before I could never do anything like that. Yeah, there's just been a, a lot of improvements, and you know, I realize I have a long way to go, but I'm definitely optimistic. Uh, I think I'm always going to be a more introverted person. That's just me. That's my personality. And, and I don't think that's necessarily a bad thing. But I think I can get to a point where I can say I'm just shy. You know, I can say instead of saying I have a disorder or there's something wrong with me just a little shy, just a, a more quiet person. 
and you know I don't see anything wrong with that at all. And I think a whole lot of it has been just getting on these videos and exposing myself. <laughs> really has helped a lot and I've made a lot of great friends you know, so anybody that's just starting to do these and wondering if it's going to help you I can't speak for you but you know, I can tell you that it has definitely helped me 100% so this is starting to get a little bit long so go ahead and cut it off here and thanks for watching and thanks for supporting me appreciate it